Hey guys. I think I should be requesting actually while I tell you guys this because it makes no sense for me to be chilling telling you guys stories when I could have been requesting. Uh how how oh two minutes. Okay, no, let me rather tell you guys this because the Uber's still here. I mean two minutes away, so and like you know well, it's like it's December so it's Zaza season like one those things so today um a self-appreciation day worked hard for everything that I have guys I've been going shing shame and I've started a new series on my channel where I share the Sunday word like basically reflect on what happened during the week and then just show you guys like how I experienced God in the midst of that and the power of prayer and stuff like that and maybe you know dash some verses here I'm not sure if I'm going to do that each and every single Sunday to be honest um but yeah I think I really want it to be a constant thing maybe I'm just gonna put some two videos out in a four weekend period so four week four sundays two videos out it doesn't necessarily have to be like in a month or whatever okay my t-shirt has dried ah there's still a stain this week guys been go like i ain't lala like i was literally going through a b um and i couldn't stop crying like i felt like you know when you suppress your emotions and you suppress your tears and then everything just comes out all at once plus it has been that time of the month for me so you know like you go through stuff like period depression and all that stuff like it came in guns blazing like it just really uh, everything just came out and i couldn't stop crying like i was crying so much i couldn't stop like i couldn't stop crying there's something that i forgot by the way <laughs> before i left uh, Godless little friend of mine i need to get some boba on my way back i mean how can i not so anyways i'm gonna go get some matcha boba and maybe get some for my sister that's if i make it on time but yeah that's besides the point points of the story is that i need to request and go to where i am going right now um but yeah i've just truly been having such a difficult week and i feel like my life has honestly been very difficult since july like it's been a hard six months for me like honestly i kid you guys not where my well-being has your my well-being hasn't been in a good place like you know when you feel like you're drowning like life is suffocating you life is drowning you and it's like the way you're surviving it's like you're literally keeping your head above water like that's how i've been feeling for the past six months since july it's december now it's like today i've just like been like you know what i've just truly really spent the time uh with myself like just trying to reflect on the things that i have done you know appreciating my efforts that you know what dude you've made it you've worked hard this year because usually when december comes like for me it just comes with a lot of guilt like i should have spent more time with friends i should have spent more time with family i should have prayed more i should have fostered more i should have done this more i should have done that more you know but um this time around i'm just like you know what dude you've actually worked hard like life has truly been drowning you life has been suffocating you you know um i've just truly been put in spaces where it just truly makes me feel like i know that god has anointed me to do something but you know when you end up being in spaces and the whole environment tries to prove like very hard that you're not what god made you to be you're not good where god made you good like you know what i'm trying to say like you're just in spaces that make you feel like that make you want to feel like you're the complete opposite of what god made you to feel or be and for me it's just like i know who my god is i know who i am you know what i'm saying like i've reached a point in my life and i feel like i'm so glad that people's opinions have never gotten to me to that extent where i'm just like actually maybe this person's right now nah, you're wrong <laughs> you're wrong sorry but um what i'm just trying to say is that i've just really been put in unfavorable positions in a very long time i've truly been boiling my eyes out the way i've been feeling the past six months it's like i've been put in a box and i'm being suffocated because of like i'm a person who's just multifaceted like i know that i can grow and i want to learn because i'm very curious and i don't like being put in what i don't like being limited let me just put it like that I, I just don't like that that's not me but the environments and spaces that i've been put in it's just like let's just truly put you in a box so that you know you don't truly blossom out and i feel like for me that has just truly been a, pro in a, a, pro a big problem because i don't like being in spaces that make me feel or that where i just don't feel like i possess the fruits of the holy spirit 
like i'm not growing i'm not you know what i'm saying because at the end of the day god tells us that the devil came to steal kill and to destroy i came in to give you life and life in abundance and i just really feel like dude i've literally the devil truly have been trying to destroy me and i feel like i said this before like ever since i got baptized like life has just truly gotten way worse like woo, <laughs> way worse and it's just like whoa you know um but the honest truth is that i'll never stop praying and i'll never stop thanking god and it is through his mercies that we are not consumed that's the honest truth but anyways besides that guys i've just really had a very, very rough week like a week where i'm just like you know what dude you're actually screwed and but what i'm just trying to say is that i've literally been going through a tough time and today is self-appreciation day i decided that i need to give myself this because i'm so tired i work long hours 18 hours sometimes i could even clock 21 hours in a day i'm tired i'm so tired like i just feel like i need air i need space i just really need to get my mind off things um so the agenda for today is i'm going to go get my nails done i'm also gonna go get my toes done because i've never professionally got my toes done so i'm gonna go get my nails done my camera is low and that is pissing me off because i don't understand why so yeah i'm gonna go get my nails done and then i'm also gonna go get my toes done and then what else am i gonna go do I'm gonna get my nails done i'm gonna go get my toes done i am going to go get myself a gift right after that oh gosh so after that i am going to leave um so i'm going to go to bram right now to do my nails um and then after that like when i do my nails it's such a therapeutic thing to do like when i do my nails i feel like you know what dude life ain't on top of me anymore i'm on top of it you know like i just really feel alive back you know like i feel like i'm back to myself like you know i'm being revived i'm being rejuvenated um i should be ubering dude yeah i that's honestly what i'm going to go do right now i am also going to go get myself a present i'm going to go get myself a mac book <laughs> to be fair i'm going to be b-r-o-k-e if i do do that i'm honestly not going to have money in a long time like i'm not gonna have money in a very long time but that is fine because at the end of the day like i'm a person like when i work for stuff i really want to point out to say i did this with my money and besides that like i'm just i'm a person who highly invests in themselves you know like i believe in that so much and right now like i feel like this is a good decision for me to make because i will be able to invest in my craft and um edit videos put more videos out because i haven't been on youtube and i really want to do do youtube you know my sister has been telling me to do vlogmas and the honest truth is that with the laptop that i have i can't you know like it's an old laptop i used it it pulled me through varsity still have it even now but um i really need something quicker um that's just the honest truth i need something very quick i need to edit videos quick you know i just really need to do things that i enjoy i love editing stuff i feel like if i wasn't doing what i was doing i'd probably be in film t television and film or probably be like a chef to be honest because like these are things that i can do and i feel like as a person you need to find your escape in life and you know get back to doing your hobbies if you're a painter get back to doing that do you know what i'm saying because life is just so suffocating guys life suffocates the living crap out of me like i don't want to lie like i've literally been in a place where i'm just like actually i can't like do the things that i used to do you know what i'm saying like i can't I can't wake up and be like, oh, today I just want to edit a YouTube video because I never even have the time. Like, I'm always working. But, like, if I can get something that will allow me to invest in my content and I am able to just take out good YouTube videos for you guys, then that is fantastic. Why not do that? You know what I'm saying? So, let's hope for the best. Um, Thank you guys so much for watching. <laughs> but, yeah, I'm going to go to Clearwater Mall to go get myself a MacBook. Um, I've been daydreaming about this. Yo, it's been giving me sleepless nights ever since I went to Astro to go get my phone in May when i bought my phone back in may i just saw it and i was like god i am coming back and i'm going to get that little babe i don't know which one but a macbook but i'm going to i think i'm gonna get a macbook air i don't know though but yeah i think i'm gonna get that my friend has been suggesting that i get that because he's very much into the tech stuff so yeah um yeah i think i'm just gonna go get that i've been saving guys and that's why i'm just saying good to let his own babies are pants in shape it's gonna take all my money but it's fine because at least i can point out what it is and it's a gift for me, from me to me because i worked hard and like i said when the year ends i'm always filled with guilt like i should have done this better whatever but now i'm just like dude you actually work freaking hard this year you barely slept you persevered you know um you've done amazing things you know so first and foremost i was reading a verse where 
uh, um, so basically I've started reading the Bible, right? From Old Testament to New Testament, like a book, basically. So I started with the book of Genesis, you know, Leviticus, Exodus. Now I'm in the book of, oh, Numbers, just finished with the book of Numbers. Oh, I'm about to finish with the book of Deuteronomy, actually. Um, so yeah, I've just been reading it like a book. And now this is Moses about to die. And he tells them, right? He tells them the Ten Commandments of the Lord, that wherever you go, you should never forget the Lord. But the most important part is that he tells them that when you enter that land of silver and gold, flowing with milk and honey, with these olives, pomegranates, you know, all these nice things, basically, never forget that God is the one that put you there and God did it like never be in a situation where you forget that God put you there and then you start feeling like I got the, this through my work like it's my hard work it's not God's it's my hard work you know what I'm saying like everything that you attain you feel like you got it through your mighty power and not God's and I was like everything that I have is because of Jesus Christ I don't want to lie to you guys I could literally lie to you guys and tell you all these things that all these fake people tell you everything that I possess shame it's through the mighty power of God like I'm so grateful I'm so grateful for God to bless these hands bless my mind bless my talents bless my hustle that's just the sad part about it but at the end of the day it's fine next weekend is hey neighbor so yeah i'm also going to hey neighbor then the other weekend i'm going to good morning i'm honestly happy um to be spending time with my friends and just being out i've been indoors so much guys like i work a lot like i don't have a social life and it's boring because like i want to be out you know i want to do fun things i want to be absurd but yeah bye let's run this errand i'm gonna come back later on and we'll do a quick unboxing together but because i might go to my sister's place because she asked me to bring stuff for her it might be a bit of a challenge because um because what because she might want to see it she might force me to unbox it so
Okay, so the following morning now, I just woke up. MK woke me up at 4 a.m. Um, <laughs> we gotta do a quick ad. Oh, okay, cool. So, first things first, I bought. Actually, actually, actually. actually what? Okay, sorry. Um, first things first, I got this adapter that looks like this. This shit is so expensive, guys. Yo, I got duri unono. And I recommend, like, when you, um, when you're about to buy these things that you don't budget, like, exactly. You know what I'm saying? Like, you budget over because, hey, yeah, duri unono. And I, at least, like, I remember to actually ask that guy about this because, um, at least I, I I remember to ask this guy about this because then if not I don't know what I was gonna do and this I can use like everything I can use HDMI USB like it has all the things that you guys can see here that I can use this for because a lot of these things don't have SD cards and that is the reason why I got it like a MacBook because I was so surprised it didn't have an SD card slot which I'm so happy that I saw that in store because if not I was gonna have a hard time like my head was gonna be so 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 and yeah it's, i keep looking at the wrong place because my camera is not with me but anyways let's unbox the real thing i still have to get like a uh what do you call it wireless mouse here is the babe ah! guys This is literally my Christmas gift from me to me. <laughs> first things first, I must thank the man above because it is not in my mighty power to be able to do this. Okay, anyways, ASMR. Okay. Why is this so hard? <laughs> okay, I don't know what happened. I'm gonna use enough because I just don't know why. Oh wait, actually. Oh dude. This can't be ASMR anymore. But it can, right? I'm just gonna do a quick unboxing because my stories is also full. This is how my nails look. I think I showed you guys this yesterday. What they tea? I also did my toes. Like self appreciation days are real thing. I can't stop skipping. I'm geeking. Okay, I'm gonna hold it here so that um when I open the box it does not fall out. Oh my god. Okay. Okay. You know what? I'm not. I'm honestly not gonna do this. Come on. Open now. Okay, cool, cool, cool. This is how she looks. <laughs> okay, she looks like that. I'm screaming. I need to get her a cover. I need to buy her a cover. Okay, so when I take her out, she's very highly protected. I don't even want a different color. She's highly protected. She looks like that. She looks stunning. Very sleek. Let's look at the box. So yeah, I got this at Clear Water Mall, by the way. I store at Clear Water Mall. Um, in the box, it looks like that. It looks like that. Okay. Okay, so in the box, it looks like that. Comes with the cable and a manual. A manual, just to say it was designed by Apple or something. Yeah, designed by Apple California. Okay, it looks like that. I'm trying to do a quick unboxing because I got to get the step in for Sunday. So yeah, that looks like the charging thingy thingy and the cable. And I think that's all really. I don't think there's anything in this box, to be honest. Now for the real main carrots. Uh, oh, ASMR. 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 Okay. I've been screaming. So yeah, she looks like that. I uh, need to like wipe her. She's very thin. Yo, I need to get a cover for her for real. Because once this drops, like... 
Okay, now I have to open her. Oh. <laughs> Guys. Okay. This is how she looks. Oh my God. Okay, I can't stop. I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm honestly screaming because like you know when you've been manifesting something for so long and you've been looking at it in store and you're just like you know what one day I'm gonna get you one day I'm gonna get you one day I'm gonna get you and child today is right now today is right now like okay I don't wanna lie I broke the bank shame so I'm gonna choose some English it's so to use English as the main language press the return key but yeah, um, I've gotten very excited. I'm gonna ask my sister to set this babe up for me because I I don't want to go through the hassle. But anyways, I'm gonna leave the unboxing here because we are in a rush. But this is my new baby. <laughs> anyways, next time, guys, I will be getting myself something because of YouTube ads youtube youtube and youtube like i'm literally manifesting it the next time i get myself something else it is because of youtube and it's not because of my nine to five or yeah it's gonna be because of youtube manifesting it and putting it out there i'm lying but thank you for watching vlogmas if you haven't watched my other videos from vlogmas please check it out and thank you for spending my self-appreciation day with me like i do this it's a no the last one i had was in august this is a new one i'm gonna have one probably next year march i gotta say for these things guys like i literally get myself like i literally go in hard especially like when i'm not in a good mood you know then i have like a self-appreciation day to uplift my mood and make me feel alive you know so just see that you know in fact like life is really not that bad in actual fact like it really comes with a lot of goodness anyways i manifested this on the 11th of november i literally wrote it down on my notepad book thing notepad thing like things that i want to manifest and the top one has macbook and i got it so soon sooner than i thought because i thought i was gonna get it next year may and god said say no more but anyways um gotta save up because now i really need like a cash injection like a serious one <laughs> a serious one but anyways thank you guys so much for watching um see you in the next episode of vlogmas bye oh and i'm going to hate neighbor so that's technically the next vlog so Bye. <laughs>